I would like to to do it more. You know, I have a tour that I have to do this year. But you have to. <laughs> you see? I have to. He's got the bug. We got him. We got him. I mean, I'm just so excited to finally get it out into the world. You know, we've been working on it for so long. I mean, I've been writing. I My first draft was in 2018 and we've been slowly working on it. So it's been a long process. And for the world to see this type of Latin representation, I'm just really pumped about that. I'm excited for everyone to see Renee act. I remember that, you know, this is my first movie. I'm not an actor. Yes, you are. <laughs> you are. Yeah, you're absolutely. Yeah, I mean, I mean I'm in the music industry, but uh, I like to direct and... This is how I got to the to this film because I'm working with Alex, who is the producer of the Alex Dinalaris, who wrote Birdman. So he's writing with me and he invited me to be part of the movie. And I read the script and said, Yeah. And anyways, like they told me that they were gonna start like slow, like easier for me, you know, because I, I don't have experience. So I I started with the little girls and they were amazing. Mm -hmm. And I was so like, oh shit, like they're they're good. <laughs> and it wasn't a slow start for me <laughs> yeah. with them. And then later on, I, I started to, to feel more comfortable and everyone was so nice, you know, so it was so easy to, to feel like, I don't know, like, like a family, very relaxed. Yeah, yeah. You know, I didn't, f I, I, I didn't feel the pressure of, oh, I'm here. And I've been in front of a lot of people performing, so I'm kind of used to that. But yeah. You also had such good chemistry with the little ones from the beginning. Yeah, like yeah, immediately yeah. they were calling you Poppy, even like yeah, yeah, off yeah, screen yeah. and everything. And it was just, it was beautiful to see that like yeah, yeah. love you had. Like I direct my videos. So this time I'm not directing. So I was controlling myself. That was the camera is, you know, <laughs> but I'm, I, I was not understanding uh, Alexandra from the beginning. But you know, there, there's something that I felt when, when I was acting a, uh, that I feel in the concerts uh, when, and in certain songs that I feel it like here like, and I was feeling that all the time while I was mm -hmm. shooting. So, so that was great, you know, because it's a feeling that I, that I want to have when I'm performing in front of a lot of people. Like I have, I have it in, I don't know, three songs out of 20. Mm -hmm. So I have to wait mm -hmm. till that song, <laughs> song to come. So in the, when I was shooting, I was feeling it every, I don't know. It's beautiful. A little, like more, more often. It's always in the in this in, in part, particular songs, but also the place. Like if when I perform in Ar in Argentina, it's you you're gonna cry because the crowd is crazy. It's amazing, <laughs> you know. Like it depends on where you perform to and the crowd. But yeah, it's every these particular songs give me that feeling that I I felt with with your script and them. I'm not tired of the music industry. I've been for a long time, but I felt it so relaxing. Mm -hmm. I know that this this was a different kind of a set and we were kind of like a family. You had the family vibe, but I don't know, like I, 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 I'm ready to, to start doing this more. And mm -hmm. yeah, and I've been performing for 20 years. So I'm kind of like, yeah, let's do this. Rene called me and he was like, hey, I'm going to be a part of this movie. I was like, you're acting <laughs> like I need to see this. And um, I just felt so honored to to know that I, I would have the opportunity to work with this cast. Um, we're all family now. We're all uh, most of us have been friends for some time. Um, and more than strategy, I think it's just rare when you get to work with one people that you that you know and admire. Um, you're lucky when you get to do that, that you uh, work with people that you've admired for some time um, from afar or up close, but then also in a, in a film where you get to be a family that looks maybe similar to your family. It's, it's a different feeling. And I've had the blessing of being a part of another film. My first film was in the Heights and I got to experience that and I've been longing to feel that again. And so to be able to do that and, and feel that on the set um, with your story out is, is a blessing. What was so cool was that the crew, the talent, writer, director, producers, financiers, everyone is Latin. Everyone is bilingual. Mm -hmm. So I would be on set and the sound guy would be setting me up and he's talking Spanish to the grip. And I'm just mm -hmm. like, I, as you know, as a white passing Puerto Rican person, like I don't get to honor that part of my identity very often. And so to be able, as you said, to be a part of this team and 
the fact that we were on location, I think just made it feel more like summer camp and allowed more intimacy to develop because we could, or we would have to go to dinner together yeah. after and help each other with shit that came up, yeah. you know? But I mean, it was really beautiful. I mean, even Lynette, one of our producers always jokes that like, I I just dance at a real kid, like, you know? Yes. Every moment I get to grab Lynette, I'm like, and we go in. And it's yeah. like, that's such a special, um, to be able to work with people that understand your culture and understand what that's like. I loved how bilingual it was, actually. It was awesome. I have never had that experience. You know, I've been on other sets on smaller things, but the fact that sometimes I didn't even know what language I was speaking on. And I was <laughs> talking to like a white American. I was like, I'm sorry. They're like, I actually got most of that. So that's fine. <laughs>